Thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Former President Donald Trump grossly exaggerated his net worth on financial disclosure forms for a decade, cooking the books by as much as $2.2 billion in a single year, New York Attorney General Letitia James alleged in court papers filed Wednesday. The fresh claims came in documents in which James' office asked a judge to rule on parts of her $250 million lawsuit against the ex-president, his company the Trump Organization, and kids Eric and Donald Trump Jr. over alleged staggering fraud. By allegedly lying on the forms for a decade, Trump, 77, received more favorable loan and insurance terms, reaping hundreds of millions of dollars in ill-gotten savings and profits, the Manhattan Supreme Court filing states. His net worth was actually between 17 and 39 percent or $812 million, to $2.2 billion less than what he claimed on yearly statements of financial condition from 2011 through 2021, the AG's office said in the court docs. For instance, Trump's net worth in 2014 was placed at $5.77 billion on his disclosure form, when in reality it was actually $2.2 billion less or $3.55 billion, the filing claims. The case is set for trial in October, but James' office argued the judge can at least rule on one of the fraud claims before then. To make a ruling on the one fraud claim, Manhattan Supreme Court Justice Arthur Engerin, who is overseeing the case, only needs to determine whether the statements of financial condition were misleading, and whether Trump repeatedly used the forms for financial transactions, the AG said. The answer to both questions is a resounding yes based on the mountain of undisputed evidence, the filing claims. Trump's financial disclosures don't even remotely reflect what he was actually worth, the AG's office said. The 45th president and his team employed a variety of deceptive schemes to grossly inflate values, the papers allege. Trump allegedly lied about the available cash he had and overvalued his real estate properties, adding in a boost of value for the Trump brand and ignoring legal restrictions on development rights, the AG argued in her 2022 suit. For instance, Trump said his 40 Wall Street property was worth $530 million in 2013, when it was appraised at $220 million the year before, the AG said. He also claimed his Trump Tower triplex was 30,000 square feet when it was actually just under 11,000 square feet, placing the unit's worth at $327 million, a price that no New York apartment has ever sold for, James argued in the suit. Trump's lawyers didn't immediately return a request for comment Wednesday. The embattled real estate tycoon is separately facing four criminal indictments in four different states, including the Manhattan District Attorney's Office's Hush Money case, the Justice Department's Mar-a-Lago documents case in Florida, another federal case in.